Hello all, it's your girl Tiffany, Madam Luscious Black Beauty, your Poetic Psychic Pisces, High Priestess, aka the light that shines like a diamond, also known as your modern day nun, one who isn't within a coven, a convent, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching on today. This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. So please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not, and without any further ado, we are going to get into today's messages. Let's see what's going on, guys. <laughs> First message here, we have blocked calls, okay? So um, you all could be experiencing some type of blocked calls. We have, they're trying to catfish you. Okay, um, somebody has a stalker that you're dealing with, or you could be getting stalked and harassed at this time. Okay, all kind of messages want to pop out. Hold on, we have satanic cults here, neighborhood watch criminals. So you have people who are in your neighborhood. Um, you know how you see those old neighborhood watch signs um, in neighborhoods? These individuals are actually criminals themselves, okay? Um, they're sellouts to the satanic powers that be. And they are committing crime, okay? But they're also the very ones in the neighborhood who, you know, are the neighborhood rats, the neighborhood snitches, okay? Um, that uh, work with the satanic powers that be, um who report certain things, but really and truly, they are sellouts themselves, okay, to be quite honest with you, okay, um, we have them folks ain't right, so you're definitely messing with, uh, dealing, uh, with someone who's not right, and this falls right up under this stalker person here, we're gonna see what other messages we have, okay, Spirit wants you to pay attention to the red flags. There could be some government officials who are involved. Um, yeah. Somebody, uh, we have human sex trafficking here. So they could be trying to, uh, look like they're trying to catfish you with somebody who's trying to, they're trying to set you up to be uh, sex trafficked. Okay, so you want to be very careful, especially if you're online dating or anything like that. Um be careful of your neighbors okay um people around you and things like that don't accept if you uh don't have transportation and you're walking and different things like that um don't take um don't take um rides from strangers and things it doesn't matter if they look they drive in a nice car they look clean cut and um, you know, look like they well to do individuals and this goes for male or females because a lot of times when women are approached by other women You feel like you you know, you feel safe. You feel secure. You feel like you're in your comfort zone or something like that Okay, but these people the satanic powers that be they got a lot of men and women in their pockets Okay, that they get to do their dirty work. Okay, um Especially when it comes to children, a lot of these children, or, or especially teens, are being lured away, um, sold into the sex trade, uh, sex industry, human trafficking, and they're lured by women. Okay, these are um, uh, pro hoes or hoes themselves who are a part of some type of prostitution ring, human sex trafficking ring. Okay, they're part of witch covens and cults, satanic cults, and different things, and they're used as bait to go out and recruit um, new fresh meat, okay, that they could uh, sell into, set up and sell into sex trafficking, okay? Um, we have here at the bottom of the deck, your mother set you up to hide what she did to you, okay? So you definitely could be dealing with a karmic mother, okay, who set you up, um, to have you stalked, to have you harassed, to have you, the, you know, these illegal things being done to you. She could be participating in having you stalked and watched and harassed. Um, 
as well as she could be uh, setting you up to trying to hurt you, harm you, even get you um, abducted, okay, in some type of way, um, she wants to cover up what she did to you, okay, so let's go over all of this, okay? So we have block calls here, okay? You definitely could be experiencing some type of block calls right now if you're trying to make phone calls and your calls are being blocked right now. Or um, this can also signify that somebody could be trying to call you or uh, even text you, message you in some type of way and somebody is hacking you, blocking your calls, blocking you from being able to receive calls from people, okay? Um Spirit is saying that they are trying to catfish you, okay? So pay very close attention to people who act like that they are attracted to you or interested in getting to know you, um, whether online through social media or if you online uh, date or even just... Um, strangers just people in your neighborhood and things like that don't think because somebody is your neighbor and you see them all the time they live down the street from you or next door to you or in the same apartment complex like you or you know wherever you live however you live that this person is safe and secure these people who um are setting you up working against you blocking your phone calls okay they're trying to catfish you they're trying to send somebody in that can basically hook line and sink you and this person they're going to send somebody in that's going to whisper sweet nothings in your ear. That's going to woo you. They may even try to spend some money on you. Offer to take you out on the date. You know, treat you real sweet, real nice in the beginning. But it's all a decoy. It's a setup, okay? They're trying to catfish you. This person is not whom um, they appear to be, okay? This person is um could be stalking you right now. This person has been hired, recruited, or... um. Or something to watch you to stalk you in some type of way but you definitely have a stalker now this stalker could be an ex-girlfriend or an ex-boyfriend the stalker could be complete strangers this stalker could be someone who was hired who was um, uh, coerced into stalking you or recruited into stalking you okay whomever this stalker is whomever this person is that they're trying to catfish you with they are a part of some type of satanic cult here okay um uh um, they are part of some type of witch coven as well, okay? Uh, now, a lot of times when you hear secret societies and different things, you have mainstream um, secret societies, okay, where you have to be... Um, prominent members of these secret societies but they have these lower level off branch um type of secret societies from the main secret societies you no know, they're handlers and they're foreseers and um uh, uh, those of them that they take their orders and different things from they are in these real secret societies like your freemasonry and different things like that or whatever but these um these satanic cults, these witch covens, these sex rings and different things that are, you know, uh, the underground stuff that is going on They're Like I said, their handlers are individuals higher up in power and authority, um, who are in these mainstream secret societies these other individuals like the individuals that they recruit to catfish you to hack you to to stalk you they're a part of a lower level secret society here which is really and truly a satanic cult here okay um this cult they get together they have meetings they do rituals they do all type of satanic masonic demonic things okay these individuals are also part of this neighborhood watch criminals here okay so you have individuals in your neighborhood don't think because somebody is uh an elder somebody is older that that must mean that they're upstanding and they're righteous okay these people sold out long time ago okay and that's a part of their persona okay they play the role and you know a lot of times the older the person is they're the very ones that's at home all the time or you know on the lookout all the time so these individuals as you come and go if you notice they're coming and going at the same time or they're just so happen always on their porch or you know sitting out or doing something out in the lawn and they may even speak to you and different things like that but these are the neighborhood watch criminals okay they're watching you they're watching 
watching what's going on around you and they are in fact a part of the setup okay spirit is saying that these folks ain't right okay none of these folks who are working against you neither this stalker these neighborhood watch criminals those of them in this satanic cult this this joker that's kind of trying to catfish you the individuals who are hacking your phone um, blocking your calls, okay? Spirit is saying that these folks ain't right, okay? They sold their soul. They made a deal with the devil, okay? They are shepherds for the devil, and they're working for individuals uh, within the satanic powers that be, and this is how they get their incentives, okay? Um, we have here Decepticons are going to jail. So there's about to be some type of major sting, some type of major operation that goes down that's going to bust several individuals within this satanic cult, as well as these... Um, these um loose cannon hackers that's out here as well that's been invading and violating people's privacy and 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 different things because i've this has something it has been all of a sudden this has like these things have been going on but for some reason a lot of these things seem to have been like popularized popularized in a way because it, it's like mainstream right now you know what i'm saying it's like satanism is everywhere and everybody is in it and everybody is with it and if you not you're like the main target the main attack um of these satanic cults, of these witch coven groups and different things, okay? But Spirit is saying that these Decepticons are going to jail. I feel like many of them are going to start being busted for the crimes um, that they are in because, I mean, on the surface, they are committing a hate crime. On the surface, these individuals do plan, plot, and scheme premeditated murder for some people, kidnapping, abduction, um, uh, running prostitution rings, human sex trafficking, and all kinds of things that they are a part of and into, okay? These individuals, um, you know, these satanic cults aren't for no reason. We're not talking about, I'm not talking about just a group of people that decide to believe differently than somebody else, okay? I am a very open-minded person. You have the right to believe in what you want to believe, okay? No matter what that is that you want to believe. You understand what I'm saying? But when what you believe in and what you are a part of uh, determines the health, the life, the well-being, the safety, the security of another, then what you are doing then becomes a a problem then becomes wrong okay so you have these those of them in this satanic cult these are not just you know what i'm saying um whether one wants to frown upon someone who is say luciferian or worship lucifer as their god technically just as well as people who uh, proclaim to be Christian, they have that right to worship that. We're not talking about on the surface what a person believes in and, 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 and what you praise and worship. We're not talking about that, okay? I am not here. I don't make it my business to tell people how they should believe, what they should do, and you know what they should think and different things like that, okay? These individuals who are part of these satanic cults, they use what they believe in and what they're part of to hurt other people. And this is the problem. You understand what I'm saying? So, um, say, for instance, if you have a group of individuals who proclaim to be Christian, and Christians, these Christians went out on a mission and start killing up uh, doing different things to attack, say, Satanists, okay? Th them being Christian is not the problem, okay? Th their acts to hurt or harm somebody else is the problem. You see what I'm saying? And, it's, and so you can flip it. It doesn't matter whether you worship Lucifer or Satan or the devil, however you want to say it, as your God, that's your business. But when you are a part of something like a satanic cult that stalk people, that harass people, that terrorize people, that torture people, that do black magic and voodoo and cast curses and spells on people to cause people to be ill, to cause people to, fall, uh, to, to, to die, to cause people to attack people's finances, to, pack, to attack people's jobs, to attack people's livelihoods 
good to attack, attack people's minds body souls to attack people's love life you know to do things to really hurt and harm someone that is what the problem is i'm not telling you what you should or shouldn't believe in okay that is your business and it is your right as um um a human being period whether you're an american citizen or not because people all over the world come online and watch things okay so you have the right to believe in whatever you want to believe in what i'm saying is for those of them who is a part of a cult or a group or an organization or a secret society or a clique or a gang or a mob or an organization whatever label or title you want to put on it if you hurt people people if you harm people if you seek to destroy people sabotage and ruin people invade and violate people then that is what is the problem that is what is wrong okay but spirit is saying that these decepticons are going to jail because many of them well all of them they're deceivers they're manipulators okay and this little game that they play is all about manipulation. It's all about control. It's all about power. And at the end of the day, everybody is striving to obtain as much finances, money, and resources that they possibly can here, okay? But something major is going on with these satanic cults here. They're about to get busted, okay, for... Um, um, they're cruel and unusual punishments. They're um, terroristic acts. Okay, um, and a multitude of different things that they're involved in, like human sex trafficking here, like stalking and harassment here, like hacking, um, and different things that they are a part of here. So now we have human sex trafficking, and this sits right next to Decepticons going to jail. I feel like the human sex trafficking is going to be the very thing that busts uh these satanic cults wide open okay because the prostitution rings the human sex trafficking drug trafficking organ harvesting um uh, all these things is what is going to blow the lid off of this witchcraft sorcery black magic voodoo that these people are doing as well because these individuals these witch practitioners are coming together are 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 um the, and these individuals are under contract, okay? They have signed a blood contract, okay? And what they do is they try to sacrifice the lives of other people to, to harvest their energy, to steal the souls of other individuals here, okay? So you can have someone who you thought was your girlfriend or your boyfriend or someone who is a friend or co-worker or neighbor or family member um, who you don't know who is a part of such a thing and you have no idea that they are a part of a satanic cult and they offered you up as a sacrifice. So then their mission becomes um, trying to get rid of you and they do so by various different mechanisms, by targeting you, okay? By doing black magic and voodoo on you, casting curses and spells upon you, okay? To try to cause you to have some type of psychotic break, to push you over the edge, to cause you to commit suicide or to set you up in some type of way on a crime or something or even to a higher hitman to um, kill you. And different things. I mean, they partake in several different criminalistic acts, criminalistic things that is being exposed, okay? Um, and a lot of them are about to go down, okay? For what they have been doing, because Spirit is saying that these Decepticons are going to jail especially when it comes to human sex trafficking here y'all know i've told y'all many times before you can check the statistics children alone there are eight hundred thousand who goes missing every single year that's every 365 days there are eight hundred thousand children alone that goes missing never to be seen or heard from ever again and i know just because and to throw you all off every once in a while they act like they have these groups that that helps to recover missing people and every once in a while you gotta run away and you know within 24 to 48 hours they claim that they have successfully rescued this person and different shit but it's, it's all a ploy to throw you off, to make you think that there's some major task force and they're doing 
anything really doing something about this. You have to understand that human trafficking, uh, sex trafficking, organ harvesting, drug trafficking, these satanic cults, these prostitution rings, they all leak back to the government, okay? And many of these operations are being run underground, like literally underground operations. And these are major operations that makes billions of dollars yearly, okay? Um, so, um, this thing is massive, okay? Even when you hear of these little small timers and they be like, oh, we made this big drug bust and, you know, we recovered 100 uh, uh, of weapons and XX amount of kilos of, 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 of drugs and XX amount of marijuana and, and, and we busted 20 individuals in this sting, in this operation and we recovered five women who, 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 um were were being held as prostitutes and different things a part of this ring is all a setup it's all stage it's all a distraction okay because there is way bigger those are small fish in a pond okay the, that and 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 these are distractions in order to get a reaction for you because there are major operations that's going on way bigger than that that gets absolutely nothing done about it and the CIA the FBI the military the the they all know that it's going on on even all the way up to your president and beyond they all know that it's happening they all know that it's going on okay but there are 800,000 children who goes missing every single year that's just the children that doesn't even count the teenagers or the adults who go missing okay if you add it in the teenagers and the adults that means in total you have well over 1 million persons individual persons who goes missing every year Okay, that is a problem. And your government do, does not offer you any type of explanation for it whatsoever. Okay, these individuals are never seen from or heard from ever again. Their bodies are never even recovered. Okay, so there is major operations of things that's going on. Okay, and Spirit is saying that these individuals, there's, this, there's a satanic cult that's about to get busted big time. For a multitude of crimes that they are a part of and um in 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 doing and it it's it it ties into this human sex trafficking here okay now um we have police involvement here there are some dirty cops okay I'm gonna be quite honest with you all I'm not somebody i don't i don't i don't I'm not against authority okay because of the simple fact that, first of all, if an emergency happened right now today, the first thing you would do would be to call the police or call emergency services. So to think that you don't need emergency services, you're stone cold crazy. Okay. But we have to be realistic about this. Okay. We have a whole history of very evil, wicked things being done by those of them who abuse their power, who abuse their authority, who abuse their positions and different things. Okay. Um, so we in fact do have dirty cops. There are good cops on, uh, out here as well, but you need to understand this. They are all, they all take orders from individuals higher up than them and an only way for them to keep their jobs is for them to follow orders even when you get up in uh, uh up the go up the chain of command even when you get to your sergeants and your captains and your lieutenants they all have bosses they all have individuals higher than them okay they have smaller workers working under them that see them as boss, but all of those bosses got a boss. You understand? That's higher than them. And you can take this thing all the way up as high as you want to take it. They all have bosses, okay? All the way to you reach very wealthy, very prominent, very powerful individuals, okay? They all are following orders, okay? So even those, the cops that are good cops, when they are given orders to turn a blind eye to something, they follow orders. When they're given orders to cover something up, don't say anything about something, they do so. Okay? Because they're all following orders. Just as much as the dirty cop will plant drugs on you, set you up, kill you in cold blood, or anything else that they're ordered to do. Okay? 
Y'all need to understand that these satanic powers that be, they go far and beyond, okay, and what they are part of and what they do. You understand what I'm saying? So, I say that to say, I have literally seen video footage where I know an officer was being controlled and under some form of mind control and was a target themselves. And they were literally triggered to do what they did no matter what the situation is. So even when it comes to law enforcement, these individuals on various different levels, they all have people higher than them, okay? And those of them who are highest up, they are ones, the very ones who are running this federally run operation where they have this technology, where they can manipulate and control anybody from anywhere. Edward Snowden told you all this. They been have they have technology that y'all have never even heard of that y'all don't even know about. They can manipulate the minds, the body, your your internal organs, your limbs remotely. And as crazy as it sounds, it is happening. Artificial intelligence is it, it ain't even the tip of the iceberg of what they have and what they are using against the people in secret. That is a fact. So even when it comes to law enforcement and different things, you got those of them, like I said, who are dirty cops. They are a part of secret societies. They are part of satanic cults and they are sellouts willingly and they are down for the count and for whatever evil, wicked things they want to be a part of and do. But from the good cops to the bad, they're all being controlled. It don't matter whether you're looking at uh, 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 detectives or agents or whomever, they're all being controlled by a higher power, by a higher force, okay? They are all forced to take oaths. They don't serve and protect us. They serve and protect the, the royals. They serve and protect the high, uh, higher powers that be above them. They are not working for the people. Nor have they ever. This is just a lie that they told the people. So we have police who are involved with assisting with human sex trafficking. We have police who are involved with, with, with targeting citizens, with stalking and harassing citizens, with illegally surveillancing citizens. We have police involvement within these satanic cults, okay? Police in, 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 uh, in involvement in abusing their authority and abusing their power to illegally invade and violate the privacy, the personal space of uh, citizens who have not committed a crime, who have not been charged with a crime, nor had their rightful day in court to defend themselves. Where, there, where one is innocent and to prove and guilty. See, the very rules, regulations, and bylaws that they created, they break every single day. They only created these things and put them down on paper in black and white for you to see, to please and appease you, to make you feel like that you had some type of authority, you had some type of power, you had some type of leverage over your life. But there's all type of evil, wicked, malicious things that are happening behind the scenes and sadly to say ladies and gentlemen there are a lot of individuals involved neighborhood watch criminals satanic cults police who are involved stalkers and hackers who have been recruited witches and satanists who are a part of this operation. There's a lot of people involved here. Well, what is happening? Spirit is saying that there is a major operation that is getting ready to go down. These individuals are a part of some type of satanic cult. And they have been flamboyantly, okay, radically committing all type of heinous crimes like it wasn't nobody business right out, at, out in the open, baby. And many of them are getting ready to be the sacrificial lambs, are getting ready to to um, to suffer the consequence of this. Yes, and it's going to leave them in despair. 
is going to leave them in despair. Yeah, there is a main male that they are using. There is a main male who is catfishing individuals, men probably and women. Predominantly women probably though, and young girls or young women, single mothers. Okay, catfishing individuals to human sex traffic then. This person is about to be in despair. This person is about to get busted. This person, um, this person, uh, it, it, it is, um, a part of a major operation. This person got connections with some very wealthy, very powerful individuals. But something major is about to go down. Yeah. Okay. We have um the we have a uh, family room here. There are groups of individuals. See, there's people in your family who's a part of this. You could have people in your, your your supposed family who's stalking you and watching you and harassing you as well, okay? Spirit is saying that them folks ain't right, okay? There's also uh, groups of individuals who's a part of this heinous crime, these heinous acts that have been going on here, okay? Some, some of them may hold some type of position in government, in power, in authority, in, on, the, on um, the police force or something as well. But I feel like individuals that you know personally are involved in this okay and we got false person at the bottom of the deck these individuals are false fake phony fraudulent hypocrites who's a part of these major operations here yeah these individuals are showing up as false persons Yeah, some type of message. Somebody is about to get some type of message of concern here about what this, this operation that's going down, about what's happening. Some type of message, news, information, or communication is going to come through, okay? It's going to have individuals in despair here. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of messages. We got concern here as well. This is leaving them in concern. We got message, message of concern, and concern here. Okay? So I feel like there's a whole bunch of communication, a whole bunch of talk that's going back and forth, that's going around about this main male here and this major operation that's about to go down, that's about to expose a huge satanic cult. About to expose a huge op underground operation of human sex trafficking here. And it's about to catch up a whole bunch of cops who are, are, are police who are have involvement in this. Yeah. And somebody is in deep thought about this. Okay. There's a lot of communication that's going on. This false person is in deep thought about this, about what's happening, about what's going on here. But there's a lot of communication, a lot of messages, news, information that's going back and forth, okay? Yeah. These individuals are involved in uh, of, of uh, uh, human uh, uh, abducting children as well. I just seen the ch the child card try to pop out. Okay, yeah. These individuals, when this opera, when this go down, they're going to be left in sorrow. There's individuals that's going to be left in sorrow because of what's happening, what's going down here. 
there's a major operation that's about to go down that's about to bust this satanic cult wide the hell open that's about to bust this human sex trafficking ring wide the hell open and it's going to expose a lot of freaking people yeah these people are false they're fraudulent yeah they're sorrowful because the, somebody they're about to lose a fortune with what they had going on you see this fortune card here we have sorrow then fortune here i told you this is major operations major operation service here this was major operation that they had going on with the satanic cult with targeting people with with uh with 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 human sex trafficking people here the whole deck flipped over and it flipped over on falseness here these people are false fraudulent as individuals and then money on the other side my whole deck flipped over yeah these are pleasure seekers here pleasure seekers who are part of this operation and they're all about to go down. This is going to be a major, major operation that goes down. My cards are flipping. There's a young woman. There's, there's, I feel like there's a multitude of individuals that they are working against. But there is, um. Uh, there is someone, someone could die in this thing, in this operation as well, that's about to go down as well. Or these individuals are uh, uh, um, responsible for the death of someone, of a young woman, okay? And I feel like that's going to be, that was one of the ways of how this operation is being exposed. Any other messages, Spirit? This group, yeah, death popped out again. They they were involved in the death of someone or either this main male may get taken out, may get killed in the process. He could be collateral damage. He knows too much. He knows too much and he can implement too many people that's a part of this operation here this satanic cult here the human sex trafficking ring here the police who are involved here okay and we got priests at the bottom of the deck so there's some type of pastor minister bishop uh evangelist uh uh, uh apostle pasta whatever they want to call themselves who's a part of this operation here yeah there's about to be a major tower there's about to be a sudden upheaval in this situation here okay something major is about to go down something catastrophic is about to happen okay yeah these people could have it could have been mm, mm. These individuals caused the death of someone and it, it, it exposed this cult. It busts the, 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 the operation wide open. It busts this human uh, sex trafficking uh, operation wide open, okay? It exposed these police who are in uh, who um, are involved in this operation here. And it's why these Decepticons are going to jail. I feel like these individuals was plotting, planning, scheming against someone to uh, set someone up, set some type of hit up um, against someone to be murdered. Okay. But something or, or, or individuals individuals um could get hurt or end up getting killed in the process of this operation going down yeah but this group has worked hard they were working hard to get this money in 
within the satanic cult here in this human sex trafficking operation here okay they they were waiting on a major harvest a major a large lump sum of money to come in pertaining to something okay this satanic cult they partook in all type of black magic voodoo hoodoo hexes curses spells okay and this has been exposed okay and it's a whole with the three of cups here it's a whole group of individuals it's a whole group of individuals here sitting right here with these three individuals here when pleasure seekers um, involved in this operation, okay? And even higher ups in power here with the higher fin that was at the bottom of the deck. Spirit, what other messages? Yeah. They were actively trying to attack someone who was a higher fin, or excuse me, who was a hermit. Someone closed off, someone to themselves, someone alone, someone that don't bother anybody, okay? I believe there was a major operation to try to traffic this person, abduct this person, traffic this person for a large lump sum of money. And this satanic cult is behind this and it has been exposed. Yeah, and there's gossip going around about this. People are talking about this and that's the reason for all these messages here. These messages of concern, this concern here. Spirits say that's the truth, that that's clarity here. Yeah. See, this group was planning to abduct somebody and force them into uh, 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 sex, um, uh, sex trafficking here. Um trying to set someone up to force them into prostitution and then kill them. This satanic cult was behind it. Spirit say this is the truth. This is clarity here, but this has been exposed. And this whole satanic cult and this human sex trafficking group is about to be busted. It's going to be a major operation here. Yeah, with the eight of swords here. And this is the reason why they in despair here. People are going to feel stuck, restricted, unable to move. People are going to be imprisoned behind this. Okay? Yeah. People are going to be imprisoned behind this. And that's the reason why we had the card that came out, the Septicons going to jail. Because this has been exposed. The whole uh, operation has been exposed. The satanic cult. How they were making money off of targeting certain people. How they were setting people up to be killed. How they were setting people up to be um, sex trafficked and sold into the sex trade. Forced into prostitution rings, underground prostitution rings here. How they've setting people up to be blood sacrifice here, okay? Yeah, and with the with the page of swords at the bottom of the deck here, with the page of swords at the bottom of the deck, there's a lot of gossip that's going on about this here. Okay, and it's sitting here with the seven of swords and 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 the um. Oh, God. It's sitting here with the Seven of Swords and the High Priestess, okay? With the Eight of Coins here. This is a major operation here. There's gossip and rumors going around about how these people uh, are sneaking and creeping, trying to get away with something, how these individuals stole something, how these individuals in, were involved with all these secret operations, these things that was the secret knowledge that was going on behind the scenes here. This was their job. This was an operation. This is the money that they made from, from what they did here. I told you they were working hard getting in these fortunes, and they were making this money by setting people up to be targeted, setting people up. The satanic cult was setting people up to be targeted, to have them abducted, to have them uh, uh, forced into uh, the sex trade, a part of this human sex trafficking ring, having these people um, abducted and sex trafficked, okay? Even setting individuals up to be uh, uh, blood sacrificed and killed, and they were making hella fine money off of this. Yeah. These individuals, these individuals, um, they abduct children, young women, single mothers, and their children. All kinds of individuals. Little girls, little boys, young women, young men, single mothers. The satanic cult was setting up, targeting. And your government is behind it. People in power are behind it, running this whole operation. See, they have individuals on a lower level that they get to do the dirty work 
okay? But these individuals who are high up in power, who are a part of these secret societies, are the handlers of those of them who are sold out on a lower level that was running this operation for them, running the drug trafficking operation, running the human trafficking operation, running this, uh, this satanic cult that these individuals are sold out to, where they are under contract. Where they have to do all type of satanic, masonic, demonic rituals and practices. Setting people up to be killed. Setting people up to be human traffic. Spirit saying this is the truth. This is clarity. But these people are sitting in despair and sorrow here. Because their money is coming to an end. Because this is being exposed. Yeah. We got the ten of swords at the bottom of the deck here ultimate betrayal here by various different people this is a huge operation that is about to go down huge operation that is about to go down okay these people are in sorrow about this fortune here from servicing these pleasure seekers here do you see they were making money for servicing these people, abducting people, human trafficking people, targeting certain individuals for these pleasure seekers here, okay? In this trafficking operation. Didn't I tell you you were being stalked? Somebody was being stalked, okay? They were trying to catfish you with this main male here who was going to set you up to be human sex trafficked here. And this is a whole operation. If you are a woman and you are a target, you were being set up to be sex trafficked, to be abducted. If you have a child, your child was being set up to be trafficked, to be abducted. These individuals are in despair. Yeah. Obsession here. These people have some a sick obsession. They do this for the love of money. They do this sick, twisted shit for the love of money. This is sick. Yeah. Look at this. Spirit is saying that they're liars, they're cheaters, they're thieves. They're manipulators, they're con artists. See them trying to sneak and creep and get away with something here. Okay? They're two-faced, low-down, dirty individuals. Spirit is saying that they're disloyal and manipulators. They're, they're betrayers. And you see all of these people, it's a whole group of them. It's a big group of these individuals who are part of the satanic cult, sold out, under contract. The satanic cult. This prostitution ring. This human sex trafficking ring. That has been exposed. This is why all these messages is going out. Why people are getting messages of concern. Why people are sitting in concern. Because it has been exposed. What they had going on. What they were trying to do. This is sad. The most recent victim could have been a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, that this group has been trying to, to get, to set up, to abduct here. This one practically just going to jump out. Yeah. There's a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Your mother was behind setting you up to be abducted, to be killed, to be human sex trafficked. You, as well as your child, if you have a child here. By the satanic cult here. Sold you out. They were going to sex, human sex traffic you. And then kill you. Okay? You've been stalked. Illegally surveillance, harassed. 
Okay, they even tried to catfish you with somebody here with the moon card here. There are a lot of things that's hidden, a lot of things that's secret, a lot of things that's been done in the dark that's been done behind the scenes here. A lot of sneaky, freaky, creepy things going on. A lot of criminal activity spirit is saying a whole lot of witchery and rituals and secrets. Spirit is said what's done in the dark. It's now being exposed because it's coming to the light here. These individuals even went as far as to do graveyard spells and different things. These people are full of nothing but darkness. Spirit is saying. This is sad. This is sad. This is what's going on. But this is a major operation. I'm not talking about two, three people criminalistic ass people this is a major major operation lord have mercy what do we have here prostitution sex trafficking they were trying to pimp you out they were trying to set you up to be sex trafficked you and your child who could be underage and guess who they working for the satanic powers that be if you think low life low level ass cats is doing this all on their own run an operation this big all on their own you a stone cold fool no they working for high ups and power baby spirit is saying they ain't no damn role models yeah spirit is saying they ain't no damn role models at all I told you, people high up in power are involved in this satanic cult. They're involved in the human trafficking. We This is the reason why we have police involvement come out. But it's more than just the police. Yeah, Spirit is saying that they're demonic, under demonic possession here. Okay? Yeah. There's even a church witch coven who is involved in this. You have a mother... Uh, who may pretend like she's she's saved, sanctified, delivered, righteous, holy, upstanding pillar of the community when she is not. She sold you out. She set you up. And she sat back and waited. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Lord have mercy. I can't make it up. You've seen me shuffle. Pimping out their own kids. Your own mother. Set you up to be sacrificed. They sold out to these satanic powers that be. They set you up to be stalked, harassed, targeted, abducted. Pimped out to the satanic powers that be. Or killed or anything else they want to do for you. For the love of money. These individuals are pimping out their own kids. Yeah. This is sad. My God. Yeah. And these individuals sat back. They sat back trying to play God in your life when they ain't no damn gods. You a part of satanic cults. Human sex trafficking. Of women and children. You ain't no damn Christians. In the audacities of these fools to think that they can play God in somebody else's life. Spirits say they are lying, the truth ain't in them. This is a major operation that is getting ready to go down here. There's going to be a crash of the stock market. Because this is a major operation that's going down. Something, something in it is connected to a lot of people high up in power here. There's a whole lot of web of lies that is going around, okay? Pertaining to this situation, but it's about to be mas massive and it's about to go down in a major way. I thank you all for listening. I thank you all for watching. If you would be so kind to like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. If you would like to contact me, you can do so at tiffanyziggler60 at gmail.com or at tiff.diamond.36 at gmail.com. Uh, if you would like to donate to the channel, it is greatly appreciated. You can do so through Cash App, which is dollar sign tiffdiamond36. Or um, you can donate through PayPal, which is paypal.me slash at 36 diamond okay
As always, guys, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, but most of all, take care of your babies. Remember, this is a wicked, wicked world that we live in, okay? There is wickedness in high places and there is evil that is lurking around each and every corner, even in a neighborhood near you. So y'all watch your surroundings, watch the company you keep, watch the surroundings and the company in which your children are in as well. And considering the fact that you never know when someone may betray you, backstab you, try to hurt you or harm you, keep some protection on you. Y'all stay away. Wake, stay aware, stay vigilant, and stay prepared because if you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready, baby. Until the next time, peace, love, and light. Namaste. I am that I am created in the image of God.